Welcome back to Guts and Glory! Yeah, we're actually playing this game again, which is something I wasn't going to do originally. This was going to be a one-shot video, but the game was updated recently, and there is a new character that has been added, and a bunch of new levels. So I decided to come back to the game and check out the new levels and also the new character, and yeah, let's just get right into it, guys. So if we go to, uh... The level page right here, the level selection screen. We have a bunch of new levels as you can see. We have Barrel Smasher, Home Wrecker, Downhill Fun Run, Redneck Robin Hood, Live and Learn, Hardwood, Log Rollin', and The Great Outdoors. So once again, I think I am gonna try to complete all of the new levels in this video. I believe all of these levels are designed for the new character, so we'll go and check them out here. The first one here is Barrel Smasher, so we'll start with this one. Just a short and sweet track with a fun finale to help you get used to driving your new ATV. Time to get your redneck on. Yeah, so this is the new character right here, guys, and actually he is the only character we can select. This is Earl. So I didn't uh, play as Earl off screen at all, but as you can see, um, basically he's a hillbilly who drives an ATV. So, I guess in a way he's kind of similar to Lawnmower Guy from Happy Wheels, but not exactly because I don't think Lawnmower Guy's a hillbilly. Also, there goes his guns. There goes all of his guns falling out of the ATV. It's not like it's not like it matters anyway because we can't actually use the guns at any point. All right. So we're just driving this ATV around and oh jeez, I went off the track. Hang on a second. Hang on a second, Earl. You need to get back on the track there, buddy. You can't just you can't just do off-roading just yet. Even though that is kind of what you're doing right now. Smash those barrels! Okay, that barrel didn't even disintegrate. I have no idea why. Get rid of this barrel right here. Okay, maybe they don't disintegrate. Never mind. Alright, let's just, let's just keep going here. I didn't reach a, a checkpoint. Like an actual, like, orange checkpoint. So if I do die, I think I need to go back all the way to the beginning. So just, uh... This is, I think this is a level just to, you know, make, get me used to the, to the ATV and trying to control it here. This isn't too bad. This isn't all too bad right here. Gotta go in between the trees. And then just gotta go to the ending right over here, it seems. Alright, yep, there we go. That's that's the ending right there. There we go. Locked on target and right through the fence. Oh my god! Um, well. <laughs> um, I think I broke the wheel. I think my ATV only has three wheels now, guys. I think I think one of the wheels flew off. Um, I'm not, I'm not really sure, but I just broke down the fence. Um... Well, I do know that, that I don't have a wheel, because I can barely turn to the right now. I did see it fly off, though, so... Alright. Well, there we go. That was the first level, then, so next up we'll go to is Home Wrecker. Alright. Just to get ourselves used to controlling the ATV. It's 10 a.m., and Earl's ready for some drunken fun. Time to visit the neighbor's fine cabin homes, and I couldn't read the rest of that. Alright, let's choose Earl again. Okay, we're actually inside the, the log cabin here. Alright. Smash through the window. There we go. Oh, we're gonna smash through the, through the window of another log cabin here. There we go, let's just cause some destruction here, guys. Just completely annihilated their their flat-screen TV right there. Oh my god, look at the way his arms are jiggling. They're like jelly, for goodness sakes. Oh, and I have a piece of glass stuck in me that just disappeared. Okay, there we go. Just make a nice, a nice, like, like, calm entrance. Even though that wasn't really calm because I, I smashed their window, but whatever. Um, can I, can I go up these stairs? Oh, I can drive up the stairs, okay. I'll go in through here. There we go. Just yeah, shake that glass off, Earl. It's no big deal. You're not gonna, you know, you're not you're not gonna get cut or anything. No, glass is completely safe. Oh god, I'm getting hit with arrows. Hang on a second. No, 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 no. You're not gonna stop me today. You ain't gonna stop me today. I guess I'm in the mud here because I'm having a bit of a difficult time controlling it. Wow, really? I got obliterated with an arrow. Well, hang on a second. I'm still going towards the finish. Or does does that not count? It, it doesn't count, does it? And... Oh, I need to go back to the beginning. Well, screw you too, game. There we go. What an accomplishment. All right. I actually had to try that twice because at one point physics decided to to give me the middle finger. All right. Well, there we go. We, we got it, guys. So we're going to go to downhill fun run next. This is the next level right here. Impress your friends and show off your ATV driving skills to another thing that I couldn't read. All right, let's go, Earl. D -d don't don't let that failure phase you, okay? You're you're a good ATV driver. You know it. You know it. All right. Anyway, I don't know where the heck I was even going with that with that statement. Okay, there we go. There's the wheelies. Okay, never mind. I just I just died. All right. You can't get hit with a frigging with a frigging dodgeball. Dodgeball to the head. Oh no, they're shooting watermelons at me. Okay, well that just cut me in half. 
Alright, well, what the heck am I supposed to do here? Okay, fine. Engage, engage the nitrous. Engage the nos. Gotta get that nos, boy. There you go, you can't hit me. Get, get, get annihilated. Oh my god, what the heck is going on? I can barely... Holy jeez, like, break. Break, please. This thing can barely break, it seems. Alright, does this, does this stuff not, not regenerate? My turbo boost doesn't... What the heck exploded? How did I even... <laughs> okay. This, this game is, is already pissing me off here. Okay, let's just go. Let's just go. Don't stop it. Oh, because there's landmines. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's stuff that I'm not even... Stuff that I'm not even gonna be able to to see at until it's until it's too late. Because I need to focus on a whole bunch of other of other things. Yeah, okay. Okay, okay. I see. I see it. Well, we're gonna go. We're gonna go here. And I think I just drifted into a landmine. There we go. Just get, get to that checkpoint right there, and then we can restart from there. Nice, we got it. Don't let it phase you. Just don't let it phase you. Okay, well, you let it phase you, and that's that's what ends up happening. That's that's what happens when you when you let it phase you. All right, you need to just go. You need to just wait. Just wait, and now you gotta go. Okay, never mind. I guess I guess you can't do that either. Hit the NOS, boy! Okay, that still didn't work. There we go. That's how you do it. Okay, never mind. That is not how you do it. There we go. Come at that from the side. And you know what? I think. Well, actually, I do need I do need to move through the the checkpoint, right? Oh, okay. Oh, okay, you're not gonna let me cheese it, I guess. I just- I just need to go then. Wow, what was that dodge? What was that dodge right there? That was an amazing dodge, though. I will at least commend you for that. Oh, good. Look at the drifting. Okay, I can't even control this thing anymore. Alright. So it seems like my boost doesn't actually regenerate. Unlike in Happy Wheels with, like, the moped couple. So I just need to go then. Alright, we're doing this with just one arm. We don't need- we don't need the- we, do, we can just do this with one arm, though. I mean, we don't need- we don't need two arms to do this. Who the heck thinks we need two arms to do this? Are you insane? Are you mentally insane? Oh my god, I think- I think the game's developer's mentally insane. What is going on here? You're shooting, like, bombs at me. Okay, go away, please. I would rather not have this right now. I can barely steer this thing, because I'm only steering it with one arm. Okay, don't- don't get near it. Please do not get near that. Okay, what the heck is going on here? Holy jeez. Holy jeez, boys. Okay. And now it's just up here, so I need to really... We need to really swerve and avoid right here. We do have the, the, the power of the drifting skills, though. So we could possibly do this. We could possibly do this. Don't give up. Don't give up. Okay, this thing is like floating in the air. Godlike skills! Yeah, and he did it with just one arm, too. I would say that's godlike. I would definitely say that's godlike. Alright, next up we'll uh, go to is... Redneck Robin Hood. The rich guy in the cabin at the top of the hill is a total jerk. He's fortified the castle to keep out the peasants in the valley, finding weaknesses in defenses, smashes stuff, and something else that I once again couldn't read. And by the way, guys, even though I did say I was going to try and beat all of these levels, if I do take too long, or if these levels are too hard for me to beat, because I suck at it, then I will just continue on to, uh the next level, because I don't want to spend too much time on just one level in particular. I do want to try and, you know, check out some of the other levels. So I'm not going to waste my time on just one of these levels in particular. Oh, geez, that was that was a nice dodge right there, though. Okay, that wasn't a good dodge. How did that even hit me? Like, it, it barely even... It scraped my leg, I would say. And that, that... Okay, well, actually, you know what? Oh, wait, there's another... There's another, uh... Cannon over there. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna do this. You you will not stop me. You will not stop me from, from conquering your castle. You're just not going to do it. You're just not going to do it. You're not going to do it. Oh my god. Oh my god. There's things flying everywhere. There's things flying everywhere. I need to get away from this. I need to weave. I need to weave and leave. Oh my god, I really need to leave right now. Wait, did that thing explode in the air? I'm sorry? Excuse me? Yeah, they're throwing bombs. Okay. It's like if it just if it just just nudges me, then then it'll it'll kill me. Okay, you know what? You know what? How about I go to the long trail over here? Okay, there's there's arrows. Okay, well he has this place guarded really well. I'll, I'll at least commend him for that. Oh, he even has the saws too. Okay, so this it, can I just like go in either route? Yeah, I guess I guess I can. It doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't even matter, honestly. Oh my god, it just hit my gun rack. Okay. Well, we'll go then. Wait, did my, did one of my tires pop? I can't even, I can't even tell. I feel like it, it might have, though. Oh my god. Can you, can you go any slower? Are you serious? Don't mind me. I'm just, I'm just taking a, a nice, a nice little stroll in my ATV. I mean you no harm. I mean you no harm whatsoever. 
Don't worry about me. Don't worry about me. Just having a nice drive here with on my ATV with on my ATV. I'm also not very good at English. I failed English class when I was in when I was uh, back in elementary school. All right. Oh wait, I need to go around his forces. Seriously, I tried so hard and got so far, but in the end, it didn't even matter. <laughs> Darn it! I was like, I was like that close, but then I decided, I decided to just to just crash into it. Okay, I guess I need to go around it then. Like I said, if I take too long, guys, I am just going to skip this level. It's not like I need to beat it in order to go on to the next level anyway. So, okay, why am I drifting back towards towards the the cannonball? Don't do that. Like, like, seriously, do not do that, because I, do, I would, I would not approve of that. I don't approve of that at all. Oh wow, that was a, that was a pro dodge of the century right there. Okay, which, which direction? Which direct? Okay, I need to get, I need to get up this way. Hang on a second. Don't stop your drifting. Stop your drifting, you fool. There we go. There we go. Now just get in. Get in. Get rid of that stupid watermelon. There we go. All right. Well, that was, that was a checkpoint that I could restart at. So now I just need to go downhill. Yeah, I just need to go back to the bottom. Alright. Well, that shouldn't be hard. Oh my god, this thing is so hard to control, though. Oh, okay, that, that didn't work. We Dead. You know, I really- I still really like how, uh, the characters get all this member- What the heck even was that? <laughs> As I was saying, I still like how all the characters do get dismembered, though. It's a really nice- really, uh, nice feature. Got some- got some detail. The level of detail is pretty good. Oh, well, look at that big jump. Look at the big jump. Yeah. There we go. Can't hit me, boys. Cannot hit me. There we go. Now, as long as I don't hit the trees, I'll be okay. Yeah, I just need to go back to the finish. There we go. Breathtaking finish, and now I can I can just crash into a tree. Oh! Well, I mean, I don't know what else I was expecting to happen. The next track we have here is called Live and Learn. No save points in this short but deadly course. Trial and error, plus a little luck, and you'll be crossing that sweet finish line. All right, then. Live and learn. I don't know if that's a Sonic Adventure 2 reference or not. What the heck is going on here? All right. We'll live and learn, then. Live and learn. All right. I gotta learn the, the patterns here, I guess. Oh, okay. Well, that was that was a good jump right there. That was totally a good jump. Oh, my God. I'm getting hit. I'm getting arrows swung at me. No. Nope. nope. I'm gonna cheese that. I'm gonna cheese that one. Okay, here we go. Let's just go. Go slowly. Okay, never mind. You, you can't go slowly, guys. Because when you go slowly, you, you get blown. You get blown to smithereens. Okay, I can't- I can't jump too high. I think I mentioned something a long time ago about me hating games that require trial and error. So, I'm pretty- I'm pretty certain I'm gonna- I'm gonna hate this in- in that case. This is a level I'm definitely going to hate because of that. And actually- well, actually, no, because- the, yeah, the level's right in here. I mean, it is hard, so I mean, what- what was I expecting? I mean, I was going into this knowing I was probably gonna get reamed by this game. This- this absolute nightmare of a game. So, I mean, I don't really know what else I was expecting, honestly. I- I was going into this knowing exactly what was gonna happen to me. Well, pro probably knowing exactly what was- Well, maybe not exactly knowing what was gonna happen to me, but... Really? I got shot in the back. How does that even- how does that even work? Okay. Like I said, guys, I'm not gonna waste too much time with this. I'm not- I'm not even really attempting to beat this. We're- we're just- we're just here to have fun, okay? We're not here to be- to be all serious. Trying to show off our, our our pro gaming skills, our MLG gaming skills. Not here to do that, okay? We're not here to do that. We're just here to have fun. We're just here to have some good old fun. Good old Happy Wheel style fun. Give me that checkpoint, please. Oh my god, are you for real right now? You for real right now? What did I even get hit by? You know what? I'm already triggered by this. We're just going to go to the next level. Screw this. All right, let's just let let's go to hardwood. Is that supposed to be- is that supposed to be a double entendre? I have no idea. Maintaining momentum and high speed is key. I don't care anymore. Let's just- let's just go and have fun. Let's just go and have fun with this right here, okay? Here we go. Here we go. Alright, well, I- I tried to avoid that tree, but it didn't work, so good. I'm an expert ATV driver. Okay, we just need to get momentum. Need momentum? Fine. We'll have momentum. Okay, well, speed and momentum is- it doesn't work, guys. It really doesn't. It- it really does not work. Okay, here we go then. Here we go then. We're just gonna weave. We're just gonna weave and until they leave. Weave! Weave! Oh, there we go. That's a nice dodging right there. That's some good dodging. Okay, well, that wasn't good dodging. Why am I not allowed to use my guns? Like, really, why, why, why am I not allowed to use my guns here? 
and just just shoot these stupid things. Oh wow, that was some good dodging. That was some good dodging. Okay, here we go. Just just move around, move around. They're still trying to shoot at me. As long as I get to that orange checkpoint, then I'll be okay. I will be just perfectly normal, perfectly normal human being. There we go. I got it. Okay, well I actually managed to smash the barrel that time. Managed to do it that time. Okay, now I need to go all the way downhill. Okay, well at least I can I can continue on. Th like I can restart from that checkpoint. I mean, wait, why is why is there a thing floating in the air? Was that like a leaf floating in the air? I have no idea. Oh, good control. Need good control. There we go. Nice. Oh, now we need to go all the way over there. Okay. Yeah, I see. I tried to get myself lined up perfectly with this so that I don't hit the trees. There we go. I think I'm. I've gotten it. If I could just stop being so nervous with the controls. Okay, that was that was kind of good, I guess. Kind of. Oh God. Going through the minefield or the cannon field. I don't. I don't know what to what to even call this anymore. Oh wow. Okay. That was a that was a good jump right there. Thank you very much for that. I I really do appreciate that. All right. Got some turbos right here. Just gotta gotta speed through this. Okay. Really don't know how that didn't that didn't kill me. I really don't. There we go. Just get through all of that. I need some speed in order to get through all of this. Well, actually, I could probably just no. I can't. I can't just clip this because it's inside. Actually, could I could I dodge you? Okay, never mind. I can't actually dodge you here. Okay. Why is it that when I use my turbo here, it just it doesn't it doesn't make my uh, my ATV move anywhere? Okay, here we go. And no, I just got wrecked again. Well, see, this one's not just about going fast. It's all about it's all about good timing too. And the game never seems never seems to time me correctly on this one. Well, I mean, it's not really... Well, I mean, I really shouldn't be blaming the game for that. I mean, it's my fault. Oh my god, there's like no way to, to dodge it. There we go. There we go. Got it. Oh, good dodge. Good dodge. All right, good. You got the good dodging. Got the good dodging. Right about now you could go. Go! Oh my god. Thank you very much. Holy jeez. I'm not staying on the course. I don't trust... The, I don't even trust the course anymore, guys. I just don't. All right, fan frickin' tastic. I was still able to complete that though. That wasn't that wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad at all. All right, let's just go to to log rolling now. I guess this is rage face difficulty. So I guess this is the hardest one. Now, actually, there is an adrenaline feature in the game which I can use to to uh, make the game run a lot slower, like like move in slow motion. But I'm not entirely sure what uh, what it is though. Like, what, what, uh, button to use. Also, yeah, the checkpoint's right up there, but I need to, like, I need to get somewhere in order to, like, I need to go off a ramp in order to get to it, right? Um, oh. Oh. Oh, okay. I just need to, like, go up the hill and maybe get, get some speed? Oh, okay, hi, hi, boys, hi, boys. I need to avoid you as well. Oh, okay. Well, I guess, I guess the game is, I mean, it's supposed to make me rage, right? So... Again, what what else was I expecting? Well, I wasn't expecting too much else. Okay, watch out. Watch out. Let's go. Let's go. Well, actually, hang on a second. How am I going to get How am I going to get up that ramp because it's being blocked off by something? Yeah, because well, actually, hang on a second. Well, oh, the log is key. Oh, can I can I launch myself off the log? Okay, maybe maybe I can. Maybe I can actually. Hang on a second. I will I will try this again. I'm gonna I'm gonna go over this way. I'm just gonna go over this way right here to avoid the arrows. The arrows do not see me. They don't see me. Okay, never mind. They do see me, but they can't hit me because I'm good at dodging. I'm very good at dodging. All right, gonna make an honest attempt right here. Okay, I need to stop breaking for goodness sakes because I spin out. Here we go. Honest attempt. Honest attempt right here. All right. Okay, we're okay. I'm not even I'm not even on the on the track anymore. All right, here we go. Here we go. I need. The log is key, it says, but... Okay. But what am, what am I supposed to do with the log, though? I, I don't understand. The log is key, but... What am I supposed to do with the log? Like, could you... Could you, could you at least give me... Give me... Could you, could you at least clarify what you mean by log is key? Like, could you... Oh, I can roll it up the hill. Okay, but... Alright, so maybe I can just move it out of the way then. Okay. Maybe maybe that's it. I need I need to move the log out of the way. Can I can I move it from the side though? Hang on a second. Hold on Uno Momento. 
Oh, I can. I can move it to the side. Oh, I see. But then I need to go and get get enough speed in order to make this jump right here. And how am I? How exactly am I gonna do that? I already have a bunch of arrows in me, so I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do that with all with all these guys shooting at me. Maybe we will get enough speed. Okay, that's okay. I don't think that was even gonna be enough speed. Okay, fine. Just just reset here. I'll I'll try and, and figure this out for goodness sakes, or maybe I won't. I, I don't know. I mean, I've already been recording for quite a while, guys. So I'm not sure if I will even make an attempt to complete this level, but it seems like I need to move the log out of the way. I need to move it to the right. There we go. Just nudge it to the right, I think. That's good. Wow, you guys... Oh, excuse me. You guys are really good at aiming. And then it's like it's like parkour right here. I need to go up up these platforms and avoid these logs. And also, I can barely even, even steer now because I think one of them might have hit my tires. Yeah, I can barely steer to the left. I can barely even steer at all, actually. Okay, well, good. Good, we're already failing this. We're already failing this, guys. And now we're, we're going right into the right into the things. Right into the things. Oh my god! Okay, no, that, that still wouldn't, wouldn't have gotten me up there. Oh boy. Okay. So let me let me just survey this here really quickly. So I, I'm assuming that I just need to get to that platform. And then after that, it's just a matter of going back up the hill to hit the finish line. Yeah, I'm not playing this level. Well, the last level is just called The Great Outdoors, so it's just another empty sandbox map for testing and goofing around. Not much to see here yet. They'll just play as Earl. So, <laughs> yeah, there you go, guys. So, I mean, I completed most of the levels this time around. I managed to complete one of the, one of the hard difficulty levels, at least, so... I mean, <laughs> like I said, I know I always say that I'm going to try and complete all these levels, guys, but most of the time, I'm not even being serious. I mean... I will at least make an honest attempt to complete the levels, but if it takes too long for me to beat them, then I will just move on to the next level, because like I said, I don't want to waste too much time on the levels. It's the same thing I do with Happy Wheels. What the heck was that? Okay. That, that yeah. Good, good trick right there. That was definitely a, a death-defying trick right there. Really do not know how I didn't die from that. It's like sometimes when you flip over, Sometimes you die, and other times you don't. So again, it's 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 the hit detection that's that's kind of that's kind of off in this game right now. But again, I can't be too mad at it. I mean, this game is still in a pre-alpha stage of development, so I mean, can't be too mad at this game for having bugs right now. I mean, I would be mad if this was like a full game that that costs money on Steam, which I think eventually it is going to be. But right now it isn't, so it's just a pre-alpha, a free-to-play pre-alpha that you can go and download off of IndieDB, so, you know, can't be too mad at this game for having bugs. And obviously because it is a pre-alpha, it is going to have bugs. But, anyway guys, I think I am gonna leave this video here. So that was some of the new levels in Guts and Glory, and also the new character Earl. He's definitely an interesting character, basically a hillbilly with an ATV that, that has nitrous installed in his ATV as well, so he's a badass hill, hillbilly. And also, I can't speak English, I just said heelbilly, so great, great, fantastic. But, um, yeah, so we're, we're just going in the mountains now, I guess. Alright, well, the mountains just... Okay, never mind, the mountains didn't annihilate us, we're still going here. But yeah, I am gonna leave this video here, guys, because I don't really have anything more to say about this. We completed... Well, we didn't complete, but I mean... We... We played all of the levels. The, the new levels, that is, in Guts and Glory today, so they're probably gonna make you rage. In fact, not probably, they're definitely gonna make you rage. I didn't even complete some of them, but, I mean, I completed most of them, and like I said, I just play games to have fun. Not, this not supposed to be a serious video anyway, so don't, don't take anything that I, that I do in my videos too seriously. Anyway, if you guys want to download this game as always, the link is in the description. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video I make, and when the next version of uh, Guts and Glory comes out, I think I will review it, just to see if there's uh, any new content that's been added. I mean, there's still one new character that hasn't been added yet, or one new group of characters, which is the Yang family, so when they're finally added into the game, I'll definitely uh, check them out, and check out some of their levels, so... I think there will be more Guts and Glory videos, guys. This won't just be a one-shot. I think I will try to turn this into a series of some sort. Anyway, that's all for now. I'll see you guys in the next video I make. Later!